Greetings, everyone. Your favorite celebrity YouTube channel is here, and today we've got a juicy story brewing in the world of hip-hop and celebrity drama. Rumors have been swirling that the one and only Sean Diddy Combs has suddenly deactivated all of his social media accounts, sparking speculation that he's trying to erase any evidence of his alleged hidden schemes. If you are new to our channel, support by subscribing and don't forget to hit that notification button for more updates. Now, if you've been following the headlines, you'll know that Diddy has been at the center of a major controversy recently, after a reported incident at one of his exclusive home parties last year. Apparently, there was a heated confrontation between rap superstars Rick Ross and Drake, and whispers emerged that Diddy may have orchestrated the whole thing as some kind of power play. Well, it seems that Diddy's latest move to go dark on social media has only added fuel to the fire. So, let's dive in and take a closer look at what's going on behind the scenes in Diddy's world. As we mentioned, the whole drama started at one of Diddy's infamous private parties back in 2023. According to multiple sources, the party was attended by a who's who of the rap world, including the imposing figure of Rick Ross and the charismatic presence of Drake. Now, we all know that these two artists have had their fair share of beef over the years, but it seems that on this particular night, the tension reached a boiling point. Eyewitnesses described a heated confrontation between Ross and Drake, with the two rappers apparently getting in each other's faces and trading insults and threats. But the real bombshell came from Rick Ross himself, who claimed that the entire incident was a carefully orchestrated setup by none other than Diddy. In an exclusive interview, Ross alleged that he felt the tension in the air as soon as he stepped through the door, and he couldn't help but feel like Diddy was behind it all, trying to stir up some drama for his own benefit. Drake, for his part, remained a bit more circumspect about Diddy's involvement, stating that he wasn't going to point any fingers, but that things had simply gotten out of hand. Still, the mere suggestion that Diddy might have been pulling the strings has been enough to send shockwaves through the industry. And that brings us to the latest development in this ongoing saga, Diddy's sudden deactivation of all his social media accounts. Now, this is a pretty unusual move for a guy who's known for being constantly plugged in and sharing his every move with his millions of followers. But according to our sources, Diddy's decision to go dark online has only heightened the suspicions surrounding his alleged involvement in the Diddy Drake Ross incident. Many are speculating that Diddy is trying to erase any and all evidence that could potentially incriminate him in the whole affair. After all, social media has become a veritable treasure trove of information, and with Diddy's accounts now deactivated, it's going to be much harder for investigators and the public to dig up any potentially damaging information. Some even believe that Diddy may have used his social media platforms to orchestrate the initial confrontation, and now he's desperate to cover his tracks. Of course, it's important to note that these are just rumors and speculation at this point. Diddy has yet to release any official statement or comment on the matter and he's remained surprisingly tight-lipped throughout the entire ordeal. But the question remains, what is Diddy trying to hide? And more importantly, what kind of consequences might he face if it's revealed that he did, in fact, engineer the whole incident at his party as some sort of power play? Well, the fallout could be severe, both professionally and personally. Diddy's reputation as a savvy businessman and industry powerhouse could be irreparably tarnished, and he could even face legal repercussions if it's proven that he deliberately set up the confrontation between Ross and Drake. Moreover, the trust and respect that Diddy has built within the hip-hop community could be shattered, and it may be a long road back to redemption if he's found to be guilty of such a brazen scheme. Only time will tell how this story ultimately unfolds, but one thing's for sure, the world of rap and celebrity drama is never short on surprises. So stay tuned, because the plot is only going to thicken from here. That is always, we'll be keeping a close eye on this story and providing you with the latest updates as they unfold. Alright, let's dive even deeper into the potential Diddy scandal and unpack this story further. As we mentioned earlier, the core of this controversy stems from the reported confrontation between Rick Ross and Drake at one of Diddy's exclusive parties. But the more we dig, the more intriguing the details become. According to our sources, the tension was palpable from the moment the two rap titans arrived at Diddy's lavish estate. Apparently, Ross and Drake had been exchanging some heated words on social media in the weeks leading up to the party, and it seemed like they were just itching for an opportunity to take their feud to the next level. And when they finally came face to face at Diddy's bash, that's exactly what happened. 
Eyewitnesses describe the two artists getting right up in each other's personal space, hurling insults and even physical threats. Some even claim to have heard the sound of fists being thrown before security quickly stepped in to break things up. Now, the truly explosive part is Rick Ross' accusation that Diddy was behind the entire confrontation. In his tell-all interview, Ross alleged that he had a gut feeling something was off as soon as he arrived at the party. He claimed that the seating arrangements, the music selection, and even the guest list seemed deliberately designed to stoke the flames of rivalry between him and Drake. And what's more, Ross believes that Diddy intentionally placed him and Drake in close proximity to one another, almost as if he was hoping the two would clash. The implication, of course, is that Diddy orchestrated the whole thing as some sort of calculated power play, perhaps to reassert his dominance in the industry or simply to create some juicy headlines and drama. Now, this is where Diddy's sudden social media deactivation really starts to raise some eyebrows. Why would the ever-active, always-online mogul suddenly go dark on all of his platforms? Well, the prevailing theory is that he's desperately trying to cover his tracks and erase any potential evidence of his alleged involvement in the Ross Drake incident. After all, social media has become a treasure trove of information in the digital age, and Diddy's accounts could very well contain messages, photos, or even videos that could incriminate him in this whole affair. Perhaps he shared some suspicious communications with Ross or Drake leading up to the party, or maybe there's even footage of him orchestrating the confrontation in real time. Whatever the case may be, it seems clear that Diddy is terrified of this information becoming public. By deactivating his accounts, he's essentially erasing his digital footprint and making it much harder for investigators or the media to dig up any potentially damaging evidence. And let's not forget, Diddy's reputation is already on shaky ground following the reported incident at his party. If it's discovered that he deliberately set the whole thing up, it could be a devastating blow to his carefully cultivated image as a savvy, respected industry leader. The backlash could be severe, both professionally and personally. So, what kind of consequences might Diddy be facing if it's proven that he orchestrated the confrontation between Ross and Drake? Well, the possibilities are staggering. For starters, Diddy could potentially face legal repercussions if it's determined that he intentionally incited the clash between the two rappers. Depending on the specific laws and regulations in play, he could be charged with anything from conspiracy to incitement of violence. And let's not forget the potential civil lawsuits that could arise from the incident, with Ross and Drake both potentially seeking damages. But the real damage could come in the form of a bruised reputation and a shattered legacy. Diddy has spent decades carefully cultivating his image as a savvy businessman, a music industry titan, and a respected figure in the hip-hop community. If this scandal blows open and reveals him as a manipulative schemer, it could undo all of that hard work, and the road back to redemption would be a long and arduous one. Diddy would have to engage in a massive PR offensive, publicly owning up to his actions, apologizing profusely, and demonstrating a genuine commitment to change. Even then, it might take years for him to rebuild the trust and respect he's lost. Ultimately, the consequences of this scandal could be far-reaching and long-lasting. Diddy's social media deactivation may be just the tip of the iceberg, and the true extent of his alleged scheming could have profound impacts on his career, his reputation, and his legacy in the music world. As this story continues to unfold, one thing is clear, the world of hip-hop and celebrity drama is never dull. Diddy's sudden social media blackout has only fueled the flames of speculation, and the potential fallout from this scandal could be massive. We'll be sure to keep you updated as more details emerge. In the meantime, stay tuned, keep your ears to the ground, and don't be surprised if more bombshells start dropping in the world of Diddy and his alleged hidden schemes. This is one story that's sure to have plenty of twists and turns before the final chapter is written.